So when it comes to bats around the world, how much variation is there? I know that there's some really large bats in Asia, right? There, there's some there's big variation. There's, yes, large bats in Southeast and in Asia. What's Africa. the biggest bat? The biggest bat has a wingspan of almost six feet. I have, Whoa. have a colleague who swears that the biggest ones sometimes actually get to six feet. See, what is that bat? Flying foxes. There are 200 kinds of flying foxes. Some Whoa. of them are small and some are big. Look at the size of that sucker. These are really neat bats. And it's not just these great big bats, but one of the world's smallest mammals is a bat. The little bumblebee bat from Thailand weighs a third less than a U.S. penny. Look at the size of that thing. That's uh, in the Philippines? Is that what that is? Is that what uh, it says, Jane? The, yeah. These flying foxes are in the Philippines, yes, but they're in a wide area of, of uh, the Old World tropics. We're very concerned about them because... Go back one to that photo with the, the, jam, the guy next to it so we can see it, the perspective. No, the, the one, yeah, that one. Look at that. That's uh, crazy. I think it's that, a little too close. Well, though. that's... Force perspective. That, that's oh, kind of okay. like holding your fish out a bit in right. front of you to <laughs> exaggerate. As I say, but it seems, even if it's a forced perspective, that but, seems pretty large. You know, I've never gone there and personally seen it, but I'm told that there's a place on the island of Bali where there's a guy that has tamed wild flying foxes that have these nearly six-foot wingspans. And visitors can actually come, and he'll call them down out of the trees, and they can hang on their arms sometimes for a photo. These are wild bats. So he tamed them with food? Just like yeah. got them accustomed to feeding?